the book of Judges chapter 3 evil in the sight of the Lord now these are the nations which the Lord left to prove Israel by them even as many of Israel as had not known all the wars of Canaan only that the generations of the children of Israel might know to teach them war at the least such as before knew nothing thereof namely five lords of the Philistines and all the Canaanites and the Sidonians and the Hevites that dwelt in Mount Lebanon from Mount Baal Hermon unto the entering in of Hamath. And they were to prove Israel by them to know whether they would hearken unto the commandments of the Lord, which he commanded their fathers by the hand of Moses. And the children of Israel dwelt among the Canaanites, Hevites, and Amorites, and Perizzites, and Hivites, and Jebusites. And they took their daughters to be their wives and gave their daughters to their sons and served their gods. And the children of Israel did evil in the sight of the Lord and forgot the Lord their God and served Balaam and the groves. Eight years of bondage. Therefore the anger of the Lord was hot against Israel and he sold them into the hand of Shushan, Rishatham, king of Mesopotamia. And the children of Israel served Shushan, Rishatham eight years. Israel delivered by Othniel. And when the children of Israel cried unto the Lord, the Lord raised up a deliverer to the children of Israel who delivered them, even Othniel, the son of Kenaz, Caleb's younger brother. And the Spirit of the Lord came upon him, and he judged Israel and went out to war. And the Lord delivered Shushan Rishatham, king of Mesopotamia, into his hand, and his hand prevailed against Shushan, Rishatham, and the land had rest forty years, and Othniel the son of Kenaz died. And the children of Israel did evil again in the sight of the Lord. And the Lord strengthened Eglon the king of Moab against Israel, because they had done evil in the sight of the Lord. And he gathered unto him the children of Ammon and Amalek, and went and smote Israel, and possessed the city of palm trees. So the children of Israel served Eglon the king of Moab, 18 years.